20 minutes to eat two loaded burgers with beef patties, brisket, bacon, cheese. And you have to have five sides with fries, onion rings, sweet potato fries, coleslaw, and cinnamon swirl bread pudding. Can it be done? Ba 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 ba. Hi, I'm Notorious B.O.B. and this is the Dillinger Challenge. Welcome to the third stop on my As Seen on Heavy D Las Vegas food tour. We picked this place because the atmosphere is definitely different. It's named after a gangster and there's lots of gangster-ish memorabilia up and around. So this is going to be a fun challenge. Stay tuned and see how we do. We're here at the Dillinger trying the Dillinger Gauntlet Challenge and we are ready to go. Start the countdown. Thank you. Right. I will this is about two seconds off, so. Okay. I'm going fries. I am going burger. Mmm. Mmm. You try these, I'll do fry ball butter. That's a really good hamburger. These are amazing. Mmm. Campfire. Barbecue. Mmm. So reminds me of. I mentioned that this is the third challenge of this trip. It's about 11.30 in the morning. The first challenge of the trip started at 2.30 yesterday afternoon. Paid a 10 pound mm. quesadilla. Then Brandon and I did a big burger challenge later that night. Now this is number three, but this one's different in that it has a large variety of food, which always makes it um, mm. more enjoyable than your typical challenge. Now that I got my, <coughs> my hoodie on, it's a little brisk out here, it's cold. Man, I missed all this stuff. Not anymore because of this warm hoodie. I missed the salad that was there. That's why I didn't know what you were doing. Oh, this might be too thick now. Mm. Too thick? Are you kidding me? One of the biggest benefits of having an enormous head is having a big mouth to go along with it. Oh, this is good. Guys, I like variety challenges, but a bonus is this is amazing. Mm -hmm. We picked a good one to stop at this morning because this burger works really well. The brisket with the bacon and the beef patties and the cheddar cheese. Wow. It, it doesn't seem like it would go together as good as it tasted. So I was very surprised. It was a really good burger. Kind of, a lot of tasty bacon. Uh, what is this? Uh, some kind of pulled pork on it? Mm. With the burger. This food tour is all about Heavy D's food channel on YouTube. I'll link him in the description below. Please check him out. He is a really good competitive eater. Funny guy. It's a very entertaining channel. Also, I want to thank Brandon for meeting me in this trip and doing a lot of the logistics to make this all work. Mm. I appreciate him, and please check out his channel as well. Of course, he's linked below. This doesn't look like a lot of food, but crazy enough, there's only two winners in about seven years that this challenge has been around. Uh, Heavy D did it in about 16 minutes. Rain It has the record in about 15 minutes. And for some reason, they changed the challenge time from 30 minutes down to 20 minutes. So even though only two people have won, so it's it's a little bit tricky challenge, I guess. It doesn't seem that difficult to me, but we'll see. There's still plenty of food left to eat. That was a great burger. There's some space here. The only regret is I didn't have three of them. Mm. I usually save the onion rings, but they're so much better warmer. I have to wait. I have one. I have one. I'm going to cheat. 
We're sitting, we're sitting outside today. It's like 50 some degrees. So the food's getting colder quicker than normal. Uh -huh. I'm gonna have me a regular meal with soda. I had, I had to do that. I, what's that called? Monkey bread or something bread? You can put this on a burger too. Like coleslaw. Mm hmm. I can mess this thing. Try this coleslaw. What do you think of it? Heavy D okay. wasn't sure. It's it more, just a little more acidity, but I don't like a lot of acidity, so at least it's not that. That's a good flavor. A little more acidity for a punch would be okay for me. Mm -hmm. Okay, got rings on. I'll leave them on. Hopefully, I'll swallow them. But if my videos are all scripted now, so I say it all the time. I'm glad you know that means you're watching the channel. Fry ball. Onto the fries. These are really thin fries. Yeah, it's easy, like textured. Mm hmm. Not soggy. Before you get upset, yes, Brandon just did a fry ball. It's okay. He's got his own channel and his own style. I don't do that on my channel, but it's all good. That's what makes the world go round. Now, this challenge is supposed to weigh about 4.75 pounds, but you know, to make myself be a good competitive eater, I might put like 20 pounds in the yeah, thumbnail. Yeah, to make, that's a joke. Um, this is actually a doable challenge, I think. I have no idea why um, people don't finish it over all these years. All right, sweet potato ball. For all the people that have been requesting for me to post videos, me eating in real time, no fast forwarding, this is yet another video for you. I can't do this all the time in the future, but this one is going to be 100% real time. Sweet potato fries. Mmm. Seven minutes. ice cream. I mix the motions now with dessert. How come? I always like vanilla ice cream or this for dessert. Mm. So I'm going to have to eat this first. Crazy bread or monkey bread, whatever the hell bread pudding. You know what this is? You guys know it all. You Probably. Should know, you should know what it is. Let me know in comments. Hit that like button if you forgot. Now's the time to do it. No excuses now. If you have an excuse, hit the like button. See what it is there? Oh, uh, butterscotch. And the ice cream? And on top of this, whatever this. For some reason, I didn't taste it. The peach. The peach is in there. This, yeah, I'm not sure what this is, but the look at the sub. Like a peach. Peach cobbler. Banana pudding bread. It's pretty good. All right, I'm going to pick up the pace. We've, so, we, we've been talking, we've been talking. At least I understood 
with the actual time with us. Yeah. Okay, it's a real dessert here. Good underwings. As endorsement would say, I endorse these. Burger was clear, clearly the best yeah. thing on that. Yep. That was an exceptional burger. Well, both burgers, but um, I was not expecting that good of a burger. That was the Dillinger Gauntlet Challenge. It was a really good challenge. The food was tasty. I love having tons of different options to eat, so it, the flavor is constantly changing. And thank you for your thank all your help. You. Yeah, thank you very much. Um, if you're ever in the Boulder City area, which is really close to Hoover Dam, if you're not aware of that, uh, definitely stop by and check them out. The burger would, is top notch. Uh, and the peach banana, peach bread pudding was really good as well. But make sure you check out Brandon's channel and uh, link him in the description below. And thanks for coming to another stop on my As Seen on Heavy D food tour. Ba 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 ba.